Hey there. Subscribe to my channel. And also press this bell icon. So you never miss any new updates cause whenever we upload new video you will get a notification on your phone. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So, dear brother, today we are going to start lesson number 16. Al Darsu Sadis Ashara. First of all, we will read the lesson, okay? Al Mudarris, Yani Al Mudarris Yaqul. Liman Hadihi Al Aqlamu Ya Muhammad. Whose these pens are, oh Muhammad? Liman hadihi al aqlamu ya Muhammad? Whose these pens are, oh Muhammad? If, suppose if there is a one pen, you will say, Liman hadha al aqlamu ya Muhammad? But there is a aqlam. And you know, aqlam is a broken jama'a. It is a jama'ul mukassar. So we, I told you that jama'a mukassar would be considered as a feminine noun. That's why here is hazihi, not haza. So do not say liman hadal aqlam. No, that is a mistake. Liman hadihi al-aqlamu ya Muhammad Because of aqlam And aqlam is a broken jama' Aqlam is a jama' al-mukassal That's why when you will recite the Quran There is a tilka rusul Rusul, it is a plural of rasul And it is a jama' al-mukassal That's why we used tilka Not zalik, uh, not zalika Okay, so whose these pens are? Oh, Muhammad. Muhammad Yaqul, he Ali. It is for me, oh, Ustaz. Al Mudaris, he a Jamilatun Jidda. It's very beautiful. It's very beautiful. Wahadihil Kutubul Jadida, ahi alak. And these new books, is it for you? Muhammad, la hiya li Hamid. No, it is for Hamid. Al Mudaris, ayna dafatirukum ya ikhwan? Daftar jam'uhu dafatir. Yani, notebooks. Where is your notebooks, oh brothers, ikhwan? Ali, hiya huna. Look at here. Used hiya, not because of the fatir and the fatir is a jam'ul mukassar and I told you jam'ul mukassar would be considered as a feminine noun so we have to use here here huna ala hadha al maktab it is here on this table it is here on this table okay so we have finished this lesson and now we have an exercise التمارين تأمل الأمثلة الآتية First of all, we have to consider these examples. Number one, مفرد هذا طالب جديد هو من أمريكا هذا طالب جديد and هو من أمريكا Okay, هذا مفرد Mufrad means singular, okay? Now, it is a plural, jama'a. So, hada becomes haulai tullabun judul. And here, huwa becomes hum min amrika. Okay? Now, same you have to do. Al-Mufrad hada kitabun jadid huwa min amrika. This is a new book and it is from America. Now, ha, ha, for Haza, now look, you have to change here. Look, this is a Hada Kitabun Jadid, okay? And who am in America? Now, it is a singular, you have to change this. So you know that Kitab plural is Kutub and Kutub, uh, kutub is a 
broken jama broken plural al jama al mukassar so we have to change first of all this one had had becomes hadhihi okay hadhihi kutubun jadida and hiya hiya mean america okay so we have to change like this so number 2 two exercise number 2 this was exercise number 1 and it's very easy you have to change like this hada becomes ha ulai talib tullab jadid judud huwa hum and here hada hadihi hada kitabun jadid hadihi kutubun jadida and hi min america now we have exercise number 2 هذا بيت هذه بيوت هذا بيت becomes هذه بيوت now look هذا نجم this is a star هذه نجوم هذا درس it is a lesson هذه دروس هذا قلم هذه اقلام هذا باب هذه ابواب هذا نهر هذه انهار nahar it means lake l a k e lake hada jabal mountain hadhihi jibal hada kalb hadhihi kilab hada bahar it means ocean sea hada bahar hadhihi bihar hada kitab hadhihi kutub hada himar hadhihi humur hada sarir hadhihi surur sarir bag هذا دفتر هذه دفاتر دفاتر don't say دفاتر because of it is ممنوع من الصرف on this figure each noun would be same دفاتر مساجد مصابح هذا مكتب هذه مكاتب مكاتب not مكاتب هذا فندق هذه فنادق not فنادق and now hadhihi sa'atun uh, and hadhihi sa'atun hadhihi sayyaratun hadhihi sayyaratun hadhihi ta'ira ta'ira means plane hadhihi ta'irat dhalika najmun tilka nujumun tilka sayyaratun tilka sayyaratun now we have a exercise number 3 ashir ila al-asma'i al-atiya bi ismi ishara munasib lil qarib اسم إشارة للقريب هذا هذه هؤلاء you have to fill up these in these blanks okay number one رجل هذا رجل رجال هؤلاء رجال كلب ها كلب هذا كلب كلاب it is جمع المكسر so we have to use هذه كلاب درس هذه دروس مدرسون هؤلاء مدرسون أخواتي so it is a جمع المكسر or not أخت it is a singular it's plural أخوات so it is a plural but it is a noun okay so we have to use هؤلاء أخواتي and also aqlam hadhihi aqlam kitab ha hadha kitab sayyarat hadhihi sayyarat hadhihi sayyarat hadha himar hadhihi kutub hadhihi humur hadha ayn hadhihi tabibat an haula'i tabibat okay it is exercise number 3 now we have Exercise number four. أشير إلى الأسماء الآتية باسم إشارة مناسب للبعيد. Okay, and اسم اسم إشارة بعيد is ذلك تلك and أولئك. Fill up here. ذلك طالب أولئك طلاب ذلك نجم تلك نجوم ذلك تلك بنت and أولئك بنات تلك دراجة and تلك دراجات ذلك سرير and تلك سرور تلك دجاجة تلك مدرسة 
أولئك مدرسات عند حاج ذلك حاج أولئك حجاج ذلك مسجد عند تلك سيارات Now أسماء الإشارة للقريب أسماء الإشارة للبعيد Here is an example هذا طالب هذه طالبة هؤلاء طلاب هؤلاء طالبات ذلك طالب أولئك تلك طالبة أولئك طلاب أولئك طالبات We have so many times this uh, we have read it okay now asma'u al-ishara lil-qareeb ghayr al-aqil ghayr al-aqil okay like house like car like mobile like a things they doesn't they don't have a thinking capacity so it is called ghayr aqil okay doesn't have brain so هذا بيت هذه بيوت هذه سيارة هذه سيارات okay أسماء الإشارة للبعيد غير العقل for the things which is far away from you and that is a thing which don't have a thinking capacity so we have to use ذلك بيت تلك بيوت تلك سيارة تلك سيارات okay for them we will not use هؤلائي and أولائك because they don't have a thinking capacity so for another noun we have to use هؤلائي and أولائك but for them we cannot use this هذه and تلك like حجاج we cannot say حجاج is a جمع المكسر we can't say that هذه حجاج no we have to use هؤلائي or أولائك حجاج same way we have to use like أخوات okay so أخوات is a أقل noun so أخواتي you have to say هؤلائي أخواتي or أولائك أخواتي don't say هي أخواتي or تلك أخواتي okay that would be mistake just remember this thing if noun is a عاقل عاقل so we have to use أولئك and هؤلاء but noun is a غير عاقل so we have to use consider as a feminine noun feminine singular noun هي تلك like this okay so بفضل الله we have finished this lesson number 16 tomorrow inshallah we will start a new lesson jazakumullah assalamu alaikum